Hey everyone, Token Dave over here, the dorky token black guy who's just trying to get by. And welcome to another edition of First Attack. Here, I talk about the pilot or first episode of a new TV series. Keep in mind that the views I'm expressing are not a reflection on the season or series as a whole. It is just my, my thoughts and feelings on the pilot or first episode of said series, and I'm cheating. Hell, the Republicans can do it, so can I. And speaking about something political, I am talking about the first episode of season 13 of Doctor Who. So, what? the reason why I'm cheating is because Doctor Who is not a new TV series, or it's not a reboot. But, the thing is, it's kind of a new direction because the Doctor is always portrayed, is always changing at least around every three years or so and when you get a new actor to play the doctor the doctor takes on different characteristics however series staples are there the companion space adventures and shenanigans so why did i say i'm being political well this is the first time the doctor is portrayed as a female and i was really excited about it but I figured people would be up in arms about having a female doctor with how people are going to their political sides nowadays and being overly butthurt. But I was very excited. So, and especially since I saw that it was Jodie Whittaker playing the doctor. Jodie Whittaker, who was in Attack the Block. An awesome, underrated horror movie that I hope to talk about sometime in the very near future. Anyway, so... I would normally go into the plot of what happened, but uh, I'm making this first attack as fast as possible. So I'm just going to give my impressions of, you know, just go right into it. So what are the positives? Positives are, you know, the actors they got are pretty good. You know, not only do we have Jodie Whittaker from, you know, that I mentioned earlier, we had Bradley Welsh in this. Now, I know Bradley Welsh from Law & Order UK, and, you know, I really, really wish that show didn't get cancelled, but, you know, since they were just recycling old original Law & Order episodes, it was going to happen, you know. But the other two actors, I'm not really familiar with, but we have a black actor and someone that looks like a Middle Eastern ascent. And these three people are companions to the new Doctor. Now, every time I watch a new episode of, like, you know, A New Doctor, I'm never really impressed right away, you know? It takes a couple of episodes for me, and, you know, I have not kept up with, you know, Peter Capaldi's run of The Doctor, primarily because, despite some of the things that were really cool, uh, yeah, the, those adventures kind of, uh, and I really, 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 despite the stories being great, I was not a fan of Matt Smith because that looked like the Millennial Doctor, which didn't resonate well with me. So, you know, despite all of that, you know, Jodie Whittaker's take is very reminiscent of both David Tennant and Christopher Eccleston, the first two Doctors of the series, thus, of the, well, revitalization thus far. You know, which is another positive. And as well as, basically, this episode, it didn't bore you at all. And, you know, you got decent character set up, you know. And that's why I really liked. And, yeah, that's why I really liked. What don't didn't I like? Well, the antagonist of this episode. The antagonist of this episode is pretty much like a Yaucha with teeth. Uh, another thing is, we have three companions, and yeah, that's kind of, that's going into the realm of Pete Davidson having too many people on the TARDIS, you know, so there's that, and there's also how predictable some things were in this episode, you know, but, oh, and there's one positive thing I forgot to mention, this episode actually got really emotional really quick. Something that doesn't normally happen so soon in a new Doctor, you know, series run, which I'm always, I'm cool with, 
you know. And my last gripe, the doctor created a sonic screwdriver with earthbound materials. Yeah, come on, come on. You know, I mean, granted, not saying that it can't happen, it's just sonic screwdriver, like, you know, out of the materials from Earth, come on. Now, if you got different elements from other planets, that would have been cool. Overall, though, you know, I really enjoy Jodie Whittaker's take thus far. She's the first Doctor since Eccleston, mind you, for me personally, that hit it right out of the park from the get-go. Took me time to get used to David Tennant, my favorite Doctor of the new series, and, you know, it also took me some time to get into Peter Capaldi, but Jodie Whittaker hit it out of the park. Great design, great costume, great timing, awesome cast. Hope that we get better monsters and better adventures down the road, but it is a step in the right direction, and I just gotta say, you know, the first episode of season 13 is a clean strike. Agree? Disagree? Please, drop me a comment below, give me a like, follow me on Facebook at Token Dave, or on Twitter at Token Dave 80, subscribe, and ring that bell so you know when a new video loads. But until then, this has been Token Dave, Dorky Token Black Guy, who's just trying to get by, I'll catch all of you later.